When we were young uh, and, and carefree, we, we did spend uh, a fair amount of our own income. We sort of Within got, reason we, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we just sort of got together one day and we thought, right, well we're getting married. Um, we need to save for that, obviously. We need to save for a house. We had to think long term, these were our goals. You know, we wanted to have the wedding that we wanted and we did want to get into the property market. Um, so we just had to keep focused, even though there were other lovely materialistic distractions around us, so. Yeah, we're certainly never, never the richest of family, but a family's growing up, but always had clothes on our back and, and food on the table, and we're always happy that way. Mm. Um, we just wanted to make sure that we could provide the same sort of security for our children as well. Because of Simon's job, uh, we wanted to make sure that we were sort of in a local um, area, close to work for him in case of call outs, etc. Um, so we sort of narrowed our search and then, yeah, we found this place and it was going extremely cheaply, but there were some very big reasons why it was going so cheap as well, so. I, I just happened to answer one of those telephone uh, questionnaires one day um, and it was talking about uh, retirement, I guess, or investing or, or, or making sure that we were sort of right financially, which then led to uh, Shoreplan co contacting us. That phone call just seemed to come at the right moment for us. That was our turning point, really, wasn't it? Mm. Yeah. The first thing that they did was they said they could restructure our mortgage in a particular way that would knock about seven years um, off our mortgage life, and we were quite flabbergasted at that. We were quite shocked at the money we would potentially be saving through just one simple restructure, actually. They did it in a way to make sure that it wouldn't put us in financial strife, um, to make sure that it was affordable for us, and to make sure that it was a long-term investment that we both felt comfortable with, and it was the direction that we both wanted to go in as well. Part of Shoreplan's overall goal for us though wasn't so much to get our house paid off, it was to be able to retire and not have to rely on the government for um, any superannuation mm. payments. Um, nobody's really sure about the future of that. Part of the idea is that if we can make sure that we're going to be self-sufficient in the future, um, then we're going to have a happier retirement, uh, not having to live from week to week. I think one experience that really stands out for me, so I was on my own, Simon was away and it was the last day of term and I'd logged on to banking thinking, right, it should, the, you know, the new mortgage should be set up ready to go. And then I got a phone call from Simon saying, oh honey, there's, there's a big whoopsie. At that time I was tired, he was away, it was sort of the straw that broke the camel's back. Um, but I rang Shore Plan at some crazy hour of the morning and a lovely receptionist answered between tears. I explained what the situation was and she said, don't worry about it. I will get the first person who walks through the door, we will be onto it. And I think um, by 10.30 that morning, I'd had about 10 or 15 phone calls from various people at Shore Plan going, it was a massive error on the bank's behalf, but we're getting it sorted for you, don't worry. For me, it meant we were more than just a client. We were actually people and they cared about us. And um, the services that we employ um, were there um, and they had our backs the whole way, so. Well, yeah, we have just uh, recently been in touch with Shoreplan again uh, after we've we, uh, paid off our house and, and we're, we're sort of asking Shoreplan, hey, what do we do now? Um, they've advised us that we could probably look to expand our, our rental portfolio uh, if, if that's what we're interested in. Um, if we had a higher risk appetite, you know, they'd potentially say go towards shares and things. Uh, so right now they are looking potentially for the next property for us uh, to kind of see where we, we can go and, and what we can achieve. There, there was a discussion that uh, if we paid off our house, uh, I believe it was Gareth. Gareth. Gareth said he would come around and uh, cook us dinner. Um, so we're currently waiting for a time for him to uh, come around and, uh, yeah, and, and see, uh, see what he's going to cook for us.